Prove the theorem that states that the angle subtended by an arc at the center of the circle is double the size of the angle subtended by the same arc at the circle or circumference. Hi Matriculants, so in today's video we're going to look at how do we go about proving our circle theorems in the exams. There's no need to memorize these proofs, you can actually generate the proof from the given statement. Okay, so in this theorem we have to prove the theorem that states that the angle at the center is two times the angle at the circumference. Right, so let's get ourselves a circle, right? So we have our starting point, we have our circle, right? So when you prove these things in the exams, the diagram will be given to you and thus you will have to work with all the labels that are indicated on your given diagram, right? But in this case, I'm going to set everything up myself. Okay. Right. So with this theorem, I need an angle at the center and I also need an angle at uh, the circumference. Right. And those two angles have to be subtended. Here's the keyword. They have to be subtended by the same arc. Right. So subtended by the same arc. And remember that an arc is just a section of the circle right so i can choose my arc to be from this point to this point right so this is my arc right and then i also need to define the center of the circle we will say it somewhere there okay and this is center o and then I need to then have an angle to the center. And I need to have, sorry, let's just draw that nicely. Right, so we need to have an angle to the center and we need to have an angle to the circumference. Right. Okay, and that is our basic diagram. Right. Obviously, we need to label all of these vertices so that we can work with the diagram. So I'm going to call this A, this point over here P, and this point over here B. Okay. Okay, so let me just write down what I have so far. We can state this as given. Right. Circle. Center O. Right. With. Um, P on the major segment of arc AB, right? So this is arc AB, right? Remember that the arc is also defined by a chord, right? So that chord divides the circle into a minor segment and a major segment, right? So I'm just telling them that my P is on the major segment of this arc. Uh, we can also add such that, right? Angle A, O, B is at the center. And angle APB is at the circumference. Right, so this is just everything that I have drawn on the diagram. Right, so now I'm going to state everything that I'm going to construct in order to prove my theorem. Okay, so actually, let's do this. Let's start with required to prove, right? So we are required to prove, okay, that angle AOB, right? So angle AOB, that's the angle at the center. We have to prove that that is equal to two times angle APB, right? So angle APB, that's the angle at the circumference. Okay, so I now have my given. 
I also have my required to prove. I will then write down all my constructions. Right. So with these proofs, it always boils down to some sort of radii that you need to develop. Okay. So I'm going to construct a radii P O, but I'm going to extend it to some value K. Right. So I'm going to construct um, radii O P extended to K. Right, and then I'm going to let um, angle A O K angle A O K to equal angle O one and um, angle B O K to equal angle O two. We'll put all of this on the diagram just now and reflex angle AOB to equal O3. Okay, so let's put in all of these constructions. Okay, so let's just see over here. We have radii OP extended to K and we let AOP equal Sorry, A O K equal O one, uh, B O K equal O two, reflex angle O three. Um, let's put a comma and say and A P K equal P one. Um, and B P K equal P two. Right, so that's all the constructions. Right, so over here we have a one, and over here uh, we have a two. All right, so now we have everything labeled, so we can go on to define our proof. Okay, right, so with the proof, just state things that you know, but keep in mind that the things that you're stating must in a way relate to each other so that you can end up proving what you're trying to prove. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to state is this point over here, that angle O3 is equals to 360 degrees minus angle O1 plus angle O2. Okay, reason for this is angles around a point let's write our point for okay, let's just write point like that okay, that is the reason okay then the next thing I'm going to say is I'm going to work in triangle a o p okay so this is that triangle over there right in that triangle I know that OA is equal to OP, right? This is because these two are radii. So then, therefore, angle A, right, is going to be equal to angle P1, right? And the reason for this is that these two are angles opposite equal sides. Right, so let's mark that in so we don't forget. Right, so angle A is equal to angle P1. I have then highlighted those two in blue. Right, so we can do the same thing in the other triangle, noting that OB is also radii. Okay, so this is one point of our proof. That's another point. This is now our third point. Okay, so in triangle uh, BOP, K 
Okay. Um, OB equals OP. Same reason. We both radii. Therefore, angle B equals to angle P2. Same reason angles opposite equal sides. Just correct over here. Should be an S over there. Right, so let's mark that in. Right, and then those two isosceles triangles, right, they both have um, exterior angles, right? So the triangle AOP, right, that has the exterior angle O1, okay? So angle O1 is equals to angle P1 plus angle A1, but those two things are the same, so, all right, let's write it out for us equals to angle A1 plus angle P1. Reason is exterior angle of triangle AOP. Okay, so therefore angle O1 is equals to twice angle P1, right? And I'm going to work with P1 because P1 is related to this angle over here at the circumference that I'm trying to prove eventually. Okay? I'm going to use a shortcut and write similarly. This means that by the same method, right? So similarly in triangle um, AP, AOP, sorry, um, angle O2 is twice angle P2. Okay, so in that triangle, right, that's the exterior angle. Right, so that's going to be P2 plus B, but B is equals to P2, so it's twice P2. Okay, so now we have this result over here, that O1 is equal to this. We also have this result over here. Okay, so then we can substitute that into our first um, no, let's not substitute into the first statement. Let's use another statement that says that angle O1 plus angle O2 plus angle O3 must all equal to 360 degrees. Right, and the reason for that is the same reason as over here. Angles around a point. Okay, so then I'm now going to substitute the results that I got. So O1 is twice angle P1. O2 is twice angle P2. And O3 is this. Okay, so this is O3. Okay, so plus, maybe let's move this to the side a bit. Okay, so O3 is the minus angle O1 plus angle O2. All of this must equal 360 degrees. Okay, when I take out the common factor of 2 from these ones, I will get angle P1 plus angle P2. Okay, we can move um, this plus 360 to the other side, which will leave us with minus angle O1 plus angle O2, which is equal to zero, okay? That comes from this 360 minus that 360, okay? Now you can see where this is going. We have twice angle P1 plus angle P2, right, is equal to angle O1 plus angle O2, right? But angle P1 and angle P2, right, you can even write it, right, so, but um, angle P1 plus angle P2 is equals to angle A, P, B, right, so that angle there at the circle, right, and, right, 
and angle O2, oh sorry, angle 1 plus angle O2, right, so these two angles here at the center, that is equals to angle A, O, wow, angle A, O, B, right, so therefore, okay, so twice angle A, P, B, is equals to angle A, O, B, right, and that is what we were trying to prove, right, in the very beginning, okay, remember over here, we were required to prove that angle A, O, B is equal to twice angle A, P, B, We've proved it, it just came out the other way around. Maybe start with twice angle APB is equals to angle AOB. Right, so this is one version of the proof. Hope that's helpful. And particularly, remember this is not the only proof. If there's any other proof that you come up with or you find, you're more than welcome to use it.